In today's video, I am going to show you how to boost your FPS in Minecraft 1.18. So all the settings I'm going to show you today, they're all built into Minecraft, so you don't have to download any third party apps. So everything is in Minecraft. So this is very good if you've got a low end PC, and if you want to get more FPS, this is the video to watch. I quickly want to say at the start though, if you are new to this channel, I'd really appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button, and also if you left a like on this video, that would be amazing. But anyway, let's actually get straight into the video. So as you see here, I'm actually in Minecraft and up in the corner there, you can see I'm getting about 100 FPS at the moment and it will drop as I move around and look around the world. And as you can see here, all the settings are default as well. If we go to my settings here, everything is on default just here. This is what it's like when you just first load up Minecraft. So one of the first things I'm actually going to do is actually move this button here down a little bit to so the GUI scale. I'm going to put that down to about a, uh, a 2 just there. A 2 is a good setting just there. So everything here is default from Minecraft. So what you're going to want to do, the first thing is, is actually turn down your render distance just here. Turn that down to about a 6. Now a 6 is actually pretty good. I uh, will show you that in a minute. So a 6 is very good just there. Also, I'll change this one down here as well. The simulation distance, just turn that down to about a 5. You don't really need that up too high, but it doesn't really do too much on the FPS. So you can put it up if you want to about a 12, but I'm going to put it down to a 5. Now your FPS just here, I would recommend moving this right up to the top to unlimited just there. That is very good just there. Also if you bob in just here, I would turn this one to off, but you can keep it on. It does not change any FPS, but I prefer it off. Now if we come down a little bit further, clouds just here, I recommend just turning these off just here. And particles, I'll just turn this to minimum. Entity shadows here, turn that off. And entity distance, I recommend just turn this all the way down to 50 just there, the lowest setting you can do. Now auto save just here. I'm going to turn that off, uh, just, yeah, I'd like it off, just keep that off. This is actually a new setting in Minecraft 1.18, and yeah, I'll just keep it off. That is my personal preference on that. Right, now come back up to the top over to this side here. Now, as you can see, I've got my graphics on fancy. I'm going to turn that to fast just there. Just keep it on that. Uh, chunk builder, just keep it default. Smooth lighting, just keep it minimum. Now, V-Sync, you're going to want to turn this off just like that. So turn this off. Now, if we come down here, brightness, you can do whatever you want with this. You can turn it up to the top or bottom. It does not really change the FPS. So I'm going to leave it uh, default just there. Now, full screen, I do recommend actually having your game in full screen. But at the moment, as I'm recording this video, I'm going to leave this off. Now, full screen should give you more FPS. Now, mid map uh, levels here, as you can see, it's on four. I would turn that all the way down to off just like that. Now, distortion effects, I'll turn that all the way down just like that. And also... FOV effects, turn that all the way down as well. Now what we're doing now is just click on done just here. Now this will load just like this. Now once we are here, as you can see here, the FOV just here. Now if you have this down further, it will actually give you more FPS in game. But I prefer this actually being up higher. So what I'm going to do for now, I'm actually just going to leave this default just there. Right, I think that is all the settings just here. So click on done, click on back to game. And as you can see already, my FPS has boosted up to 400, around about 400, 500 just there, as you can see. So as I look at the sky, I will get more FPS. So this basically just gives you more FPS in Minecraft, and it is totally all in Minecraft. You do not need any other clients to do this. Now at the start of the video, I think I was getting around about 100 FPS, and now I'm getting roughly about 500 FPS, which is very good. If you would like to know how to get even more FPS on Minecraft, I would definitely recommend checking out this video here on the screen. It's on how to install Optifine. It should definitely boost your FPS in game, so I recommend downloading that, and the link is on the screen to watch that. But anyway, this is it for this video, guys, and I'll see you guys all next time. Peace out.